What's up, YouTube? In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to get the Ripster EMA clouds into your Weeble so that you can use those clouds um, in your trading. Stay tuned. All right, guys. So the first thing you want to go to do, you're going to go to indicators here up on the top right. Pictures out of the way. So click indicators and you're going to scroll down to script editor at the bottom. So click that. Now, once you're in here, you're actually making a script um, by putting in either an outside source like we're about to do or um, simply making your own. So we're not going to make our own. So what we're going to do is copy and paste a script from Ripster 47. Scroll to the top, the Ripster clouds. Scroll down to the bottom. You're not going to have anything on that 38th line. You want that 38th line to be blank. And the 37th line is the last line you want um, the program to be on. Now I space this out that it should work perfectly. Once you're done, um, you're going to scroll up and you're going to name it. We'll just call it Ripster EMA Clouds. Now, where you're going to get this program is down below this video. Click underneath, and I'll have it copied and pasted there for you guys so you can copy it and paste it in here just like I am doing. So we'll call Ripster EMA Clouds. We'll save it. Perfect. Remember that 38th line should be blank. Still good. We'll click Done. And then let's go see if we saved it up here. So Indicators, All Indicators. And there it is. It's under My Script. It's going to be Ripster Clouds. We'll click that, okay? So it doesn't look exactly how I want it to look. So let's edit over here. You're gonna click the edit tab here. We're going to untab the lines on those EMAs. We just want it to be filled. And then you can change the colors of whatever you want these to be. I like the red and green. And then for the 35 to uh, 50 EMA, I like to go more of like a yellowish orange, more toward a yellow. We'll go that one. And I like a blue. Um, let's see here. We'll go kind of with that color. And as you can see here, look at this right here, the 34 to 50 EMA cloud. As I'm changing it, you can see which color you like the best. I like that one. We'll click done. And there's your EMA clouds. Okay, the green and the blue are bullish, the yellow and the red are bearish. I'm on the one day chart. We scroll to the one hour and there we go. So we're in a bearish trend here at the AMC. We have the yellow and red clouds. Let's go to something bullish. Lamb Research has been in an uptrend. As you can see, the clouds are bullish. And on the one day chart, again, we're bullish. We have the nice blue cloud going up and the green cloud going up. That's how you put in the Ripster EMA clouds. And if you want to change it up a little more, these say eight. This is the 34 and 50. And then again, they're the uh, eight and 21. Okay. So if you want to change it, you can. You can have the size be different, the style be different. You know, that's what it would look like. I wouldn't recommend changing those. Um, just leave that how it is. I don't think that'll change since it's a cloud. Um, but you can change the colors up, do whatever you need to do. It's the 8 to 21 EMA cloud and the 34 to 50 um, as well. So they work well with my trading. I like to use them. Um, but that's how you put them into your Weeble. And then they'll be there next time. If you don't want to use it, just click off of it. As you can see, I've done this several times. Just click off and it's off for you. All right, guys, that's how you do it. My name is Eric. I'm Kid Stock. I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace.